Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about function operations. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here. g of x is equal to 2x minus 2. f of x is equal to x squared plus 3x, and we need to find g of f of negative 2 plus x. We'll first find g of f of x. g of f of x, a little golf here, is g of f of x, like that. Well, we were given f of x, so it's pretty easy. We plug that in here. So instead of f of x, we put an x squared plus 3x. Then we're given g, so we take our function g, which is 2x minus 2, but instead of an x, I'm going to put parentheses here, and then minus a 2. I'm going to put what we have right here of x squared plus 3x and for what that x value should be. Now let's simplify this a bit. 2 times x squared is 2x squared, and 2 times 3x is a, well, 6x. Then we subtract a 2 here. So far, so good. And again, this is our g of f of x. But we want to find g of f of negative 2 plus x. So what we're going to do, instead of or wherever our x values are, we're going to plug in this negative 2 plus x in there. So we have 2 times a negative 2 plus x, all squared, plus 6 times a negative 2 plus x, instead of that x value, and then minus 2. And now we just simplify. Well, 2 times, remember, this whole thing squared is negative 2 plus x times itself, negative 2 plus x, plus, well, we can distribute the 6 across, so 6 times negative 2 is a negative 12, and 6 times x is, well, a 6x, and then we subtract a 2. So let's go multiply this part out, we FOIL it, so we have 2 here, times, negative 2 times negative 2 is a positive 4, negative 2 times x is a minus 2x x times negative 2 is, again, negative 2x, and x times x is x squared. Then we have a, well, minus 12 and a minus 2 kind of can come together, which is a minus uh, 14, and then don't forget the plus 6x here. I'll rearrange that here. Well, we can't forget to distribute this 2 to all parts, right? So 2 times 4 is an 8, 2 times a negative 2x is a negative uh, 4x, and 2 times a negative 2x is a negative 4x again, and 2 times an x squared is a 2x squared. And I guess I could have combined these first, but it's okay, it works out. Then we plus a 6x and minus a 14 here. So now let's go combine our like terms, and let's reorder this. So let's deal with the x squared first. We only have one value that's x squared, and that's a 2x squared here. Then we want to add our negative 4x, negative 4x, and our positive 6x. And what does that come out to be? Well, negative 4x plus negative 4x is a negative 8x, plus 6x is a negative 2x. Not too bad. Then we have an 8 and a negative 14, and they come together to be a negative 6. And so after all of that, our final answer is 2x squared minus 2x minus 6. I hope this video was helpful for you. And if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, <laughs> thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.